Hi, I'm Marco and I want to talk to you about something that uh, might just change your life. So I have been doing this podcast where I read articles and readers mail by Alice Miller. And you might wonder who is Alice Miller? So I want to explain a little bit about who she is and what she did. Um, so, so she was a child advocate. Uh, what does that mean, like child advocate? Well, she realized what a lot of people don't realize that in society, children are treated very badly. They're very, very bad. Like not, not like, not like human beings at all. Um, and that breeds a lot of violence, a lot of frustration, and the difficult thing about this is, you know, this is uh, what a lot of people uh, don't realize, and that is the reason why this problem keeps continuing, and um, this, is, this is the reason why, why there are all these wars, and there's the reason why there's terrorism, right? So how, how can we combat terrorism, for example? Right, because it's these people have been abused as children, right? But people, this is the thing. This is a very tragic thing. People are blind to it. They don't see it at all. All the child abuse that's going on. Um, for example, when I when I go outside and I see parents with their children, I often see them abusing them. Right? It's, it's something that you don't really see if you don't know really what, what child abuse entails and how, how subtle it sometimes is. Um, when they're shout, shouting at them, um, when they're moralizing uh, about something that is really not something that has anything to do with morality, like a bad children, you've been bad don't do that right it's like you wouldn't you wouldn't talk to like that to another person right if I, if I talk, talk to a friend of mine and say, say to him oh you didn't do the dishes come on do the dishes you think he, he would want to do that no he said fuck you it's like I'm not doing the dishes just because you want me to give me a reason why I should I like, give me a reason and and they do it like my the, the people I live with they do the dishes because they are interested in a functioning household and they want to they want to contribute right that's what children do too but only if you treat them right but what I see here in Germany and I I, I think in other countries is even worse is that people just treat their children very badly and. Uh, yeah, I wanted to talk to you about Alice Miller. So Alice Miller, is, she fought against that, right? She realized that uh, children are just mistreated and that the people, they, there's a cycle of abuse, right? So people mistreat their children and then these children mistreat their own children when they grow up, right? So this is a cycle and everybody keeps blind and just repeated and repeated and repeated unless there's a person, for example, like Alice Miller, or just some somebody who she called them a light and witness, right? Somebody who who knows what's going on, somebody who can give empathy, right? For example, she talks a lot about Hitler. He had nobody. Like when when Hitler was a child, he was beaten constantly, every day, bam, 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 right? And nobody ever said to him, "Hey, this is not right." Like. How you treat it, it's shitty, it's bad, it's criminal. Nobody was there who did that. And that is the reason. I mean, it's, it's uh, of course there's other factors and uh, it's also the, the problem that everybody was treated badly and, and uh, every child was treated badly in Germany at that time. But that is the reason for the Third Reich, right? It doesn't, doesn't maybe it doesn't make that much sense to you, but isn't it like the most rational explanation you have ever heard about the Third Reich? Like, didn't you wonder, like, how did this happen? Like, how, how, did, how did people get so insane about it? 
but uh, yeah, and this this is just the this is the extreme of what we are facing here, right? If we don't combat this problem, and this is why I want to bring bring her message to you and 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 to to as, as many people as possible, because she ha does have a website, right? AliceMinusMiller.com, and there are a lot of very very helpful articles a lot of very helpful readers mail and it helped me a lot like I you know it's like the way I am now I couldn't be that way if I hadn't read Alice Miller if I hadn't put on the work and looked at my own history and my own trauma like everything everything every shit that I, I had to deal with right so this gift like I really think it's a gift. This gift I want to now give to you. I want uh, you to to get to get this message message as well, right? So maybe maybe you're not convinced now. So I just want to encourage you. Just have a listen. Just have a listen. See what you think. See see how it, how it is for you. And um, so and you don't. The thing is that maybe not many people read her website, but now you can just take it with you while you're going to work, you're exercising, you can download all her articles, all the readers mail and listen to them, right? So that's what I want to give to you and I hope you're going to check it out and I also hope you're gonna tell me how you like it, like if you think it's good or, if, if, or you have constructive criticism so I would be it would be really helpful if you just have a listen tell me what you think All right my email is below and uh, I think it's gonna be very helpful and um, that's that's basically all I wanted to have to say and like I said this talk might change your life uh, or this podcast may change your life um, reading Alice Muller's books might change your life. It certainly did mine. So, that gift, I want to give to you. Please, you don't have to accept it, but taste it and tell me what you think. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs>